Here's what I'd say about, about this concept of strategic defaults. I think it's a phony concept. I think that there are a huge variety of circumstances where people are not paying their mortgage fully. And, and, uh, and there can be all sorts of reasons for it. It can be that they are reprioritizing their, that they can't afford to pay all of their debts and they've decided, rightly or wrongly, I'm going to pay the short-term debt first because I think I'll, I'd be able to get back on target with the mortgage. That could be very co common. And you might find banks hold, holding the mortgage saying, oh, this is terrible, they're paying everything else but not paying me. But is that strategic default? I, that's, that's people managing their affairs as best they can. Um, they may also be prioritizing things that they is unrealistic and for, them, for, them, for, for them to prioritize. They may not realize that they have to adjust their living standards. That's certainly true. But it is complex. So I'm not prepared really to go out and say, uh, I've looked at this and the number is 25 because I don't know what the concept means. 